Do you want to increase the longevity of your Furman generator? This video will enable you to do just that as we demonstrate basic maintenance of your Furman W03383 generator. The information presented also applies to Furman inverter generators ranging from 2900 watts to 3650 watts. We'll cover how to change the oil, air filter, spark plug, and spark arrestor. Let's begin with the primary contributor to your generator's overall health, the oil. The first time you use your generator, make sure to fill it with the supplied bottle of Furman oil. Make your first oil change after 25 hours of use and subsequently after every 100 hours of runtime. Before changing the oil, make sure your generator is placed on a level surface and that the engine is warm. Use a fresh bottle of oil. We recommend Furman 10W30 for maximum performance. You'll also need a suitable container in which to drain the old oil. Start by loosening the cover screws and removing the maintenance cover. Pop up the rubber plug from below the yellow drain bolt. Then remove the yellow drain bolt. Tilt the generator on its side and allow the oil to drain completely into the container. Finally, replace the yellow drain bolt. Do not dispose of this oil down a drain in the trash or in the wild. Used oil should always be returned to a collection center to be recycled. Unscrew the oil fill cap. Fill the engine with the oil until it reaches the point marked high on the dipstick. Furman also includes a funnel with every generator to help simplify the oil change process. To properly check the oil level, simply dip the dipstick in the fluid. Do not screw in the dipstick while checking the oil level. Once you have verified that the oil level is appropriate, screw in the dipstick. Reinstall the maintenance cover and tighten the cover screws. You're finished. It's also important to regularly check your generator's air filter, which should be cleaned after every 50 hours of use. To do this, locate the air cleaner cover and locate the air filter plastic cover. Unclip the cover and carefully remove the foam air filter element. Wash the foam element with liquid detergent and water and squeeze dry in a clean cloth. Once dry, saturate the air filter with a thin layer of clean engine oil and squeeze in a clean cloth to remove excess oil. Then reinstall the filter. It is now clean and ready to use for another 50 hours. Next, make sure to check your generator's spark plug after every 100 hours of runtime. Regular cleaning and replacement of spark plugs will help your engine start easier and run at peak performance. To remove the spark plug, first unplug the spark plug boot. Then unscrew the spark plug with the provided wrench. Remove the plug and inspect for any damage. Replacement is necessary if spark plug damage is present. If no damage is present, clean the spark plug with a wire brush and reinstall. To reinstall, place the plug in position and carefully thread by hand to avoid cross threading. Tighten the plug with the wrench and put the spark plug boot back on the spark plug. Before servicing the spark arrestor for cleaning or replacement, allow the generator engine to cool completely. Then remove the screws supporting the spark arrestor and carefully remove any carbon deposits with a wire brush. If the spark arrestor is damaged, a replacement will be necessary. If no damage is present, reposition the spark arrestor in the muffler and tighten the screw back in place. These simple routine tasks will keep you happier and your generator healthier. For more maintenance tips, refer to your manual or visit our website at FurmanPowerEquipment.com. Every Furman generator is backed by a three-year warranty and our technicians are available seven days a week to provide support. Get the power you need when you need it. Your adventure begins with Furman.